What is up, cool kids? My name's Gavin, I'm the Echo Trainer, and today I come to you a little sad, a little salty, uh, and pretty angry at a couple of things, mostly myself. Um, and that is because, as I'm sure a lot of people have heard or experienced, uh, there was a big ban that was recently rolled out uh, today. Well, yesterday at the time that you're seeing this, um, by Game Freak on the Pokemon Global Link, that banned, I think it was like seven, it's like 7,500 people uh, for editing their save data. I, unfortunately, was one of those people. As I mentioned, uh, I think, yeah, on my stream yesterday, if you were there, which not that many people were, so, um, I don't have time to legitimately breed and do all that stuff that is necessary for the competitive battling that I do. So what I do is I breed the Pokemon that I want and I, I do the natures and that's pretty much it. Natures and maybe one or two IVs for Pokemon because I do have a pretty good uh, breed bank. So for the most part I at least get the raw Pokemon there. I EV it in the game. I do everything in the game. I don't gen them with PK Hex or anything like that. I just use Power Save to save me some time breeding. Um, and, to my knowledge, I've never used a Pokemon, or even attempted to use a Pokemon, that was not legal. The only time on sun, on, that I, on sun and Moon that I can remember uh, being turned away from using a Pokemon was, I think I tried using a, uh, let, me, let me switch over to stuff so you can see, where is it, there. As you can see, we're on Pokemon Global Link website right now. And so we have identified, I'll move me down here. Um, yeah, 7,600 players. So I tried to get on today, and uh, it gave me this fancy error code right here. And so I looked it up, and sure enough, I am banned for the foreseeable future. I don't have time to, or money, to go and pick out a new game, because that will work if you just get a new game and just like put everything in Pokebank, drop it back off in the game, that will work. I don't have the money to do that. So, what's gonna happen is, I have today's VGC drawing board already filmed. Um, so obviously that's not gonna be affected, but future stuff will be. And I honestly don't know what to do about it because um, oh, also, the only other thing that I can remember, I don't even think I used it online. Like, I might have used it in one online battle, like, over Christmas break. So, at least three, probably more than three months ago, uh, was a Battle Bond Greninja, which I got traded from somebody, uh, unknowing that it was uh, altered to have. 31 IVs and all stats, which is not allowed for Battle Bond Greninja. Battle Bond, Battle Bond Greninja can only have 31 in attack, special attack, and speed. The rest are 27, I think. Um, so that might have been it. I'll, I might, I'll have to double check that my low tick and see if there's anything else with that, but this, I get, yes, I do break the rules. Those are the rules set by Pokemon. It is my own fault for this. But I see so many people, because like, I'm a member of a couple of Pokemon Facebook groups, and I see people posting like, oh, if you do it right, you're not going to get banned. I've never had any problems getting on. All my Pokemon have legal moves, legal abilities, legal Pokeballs, everything. I don't gen them to be shiny. Um, if I use a shiny Pokemon, I shiny hunted for it and then changed it. Because I know power saving some things to be shiny gets a little tricky. Um, this just goes to show, like, 
I really didn't start doing it until recently either. So I'm really kicking myself that I didn't just stick with doing things the legal way and the right way. So I really don't know how long this is going to last, how long this is going to... If, if they're ever going to unban people, I really don't know. If you have any more insight than I do, please let me know. Because I don't have money to go out and buy another copy. I did have Moon. I recently traded it back in because I had no idea this was going to happen. And I used that to buy Zelda. Uh, which I still yet to play because I don't have a Switch. Um... So yeah, as you can tell, I'm I'm quite mad at a, a Game Freak, which I know it's really not their fault, um, because it is right in the user agreement or the term terms of play, whatever you want to call it, um, that you cannot alter save data in any way. Um, but if I get banned and certain people um, who are bigger in the Pokemon community who are well known to hack do not I'm going to be very upset and with with those people who are well known in the Pokemon community I'm going to switch just back to my face um, well known in the community um, who win tournaments and things, because if, if you go to a VGC tournament and you think any of those people get their Pokemon legally, you are sorely mistaken. Wh whether it's a sanctioned tournament or not. Like, there was a guy who entered a tournament with a Beast Ball Porygon, which is illegal, because no Porygon... I don't even remember the guy's name. I, I want to say it was Ray Rizzo. I, I want to say that sounds right. Um... The only Pokeball right now that you can have Porygon, any of the Porygon, Porygon, like standard Porygon, Porygon 2, or Porygon Z, is in is a Pokeball. Because uh, the only way to get Porygon is by a gift or like the game corner or something. Uh, there's no way to catch a wild Porygon, um, so, that, so there's no way to get in, in anything other than a Pokeball. And he, I don't think he won that tournament, but he won more than one game. And they were just like, meh, it's whatever. Um, and I don't mean to sound, I know I sound like Verlicify and that's, I, believe me, I don't want to sound like Verlicify. But if people like that don't get banned and somebody like me does, like, they're, like, that's a problem. That's, that's really a problem. So if you have any advice, if you want to console me, because I, frankly, I kind of need it right now, um, please do. If you have any more insight than I do, which I don't really think too many people do, because I did look up quite a lot of things about this. Um, yeah, let me know down in the comments below. Um, I'm really sorry. I don't. I don't really know what I'm gonna do for next week and beyond for Wi-Fi battles, because I know, um, like normal battle spot like not rating but like free battles they're just they're not as fun because there's no way to measure yourself against other people like there's no rating system which and I could they, they said that I, I read that I could just put everything in bank start the game over and then um, just put everything back but then I don't have any items and that eats you know a full day which I mean I do have this weekend because I'm on duty and can't really do too much else, but I have three exams and a paper. Two papers due in the next two weeks, so I, don't, I really don't have time to play Pokemon Sun and Moon all over again. So what I think I'm going to do for next week is probably just put out uh, a Mystery Dungeon every day. So that's, that's, I didn't really want this to go on this long, just a little update. Um, yeah. So... If you enjoyed this video as much as I didn't, and I'm again, I'm really sorry because this, as much as affects me, it affects you guys more because you guys watch my content and you guys spend your time watching me play, which I don't know, like I, I've said things in the past, like I've went up against somebody with like an all shiny team and I'm like, oh, wonder where that guy got his Pokemon from. So like when I say things like that, it inherently makes me kind of hypocritical, which I do feel bad about, 
But if people like that don't get banned, and people like me, who I'm careful, I, anytime, like, if I ever did change somebody's EVs, I would go through and do it first. I would set them all to zero to make sure that I didn't have anything over 508. Um, so I just, I, I really don't know. I really don't know where to go from here. Um, so I started doing the outro, so I'm just going to finish it. If, if, if you enjoyed this video as much as I didn't, please, please, please like and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter and Twitch, at that cool trainer, And please let me know what you guys think I should do, personally. Because for next week, I think I will just do um, Mystery Dungeon every day of the week, except for Friday. Um, but at, beyond that, I really don't know. Uh, so until next time. Smile later.